on the ninth day of September. Yani leo ni 9 9 2018. Eh. <laughs> and uh, uh, you're listening to Kenya's number one Get Radio 89.5 on air. Online www.getaradio.co.ke and on TV, the visual radio, getaradio.co.ke slash TV. Wherever you're tuned in, welcome Karibu. Uh, yes, and I hope you had a very nice and interesting week. Yangu ilikuwa nesa ilikuwa BA. You know? And I give thanks and praise for making it happen up to right about now. Yeah, to the most high ja, Rastafari. Otherwise, this is Chanuka Dada. And this is how we do so up to Sasaba. Tuna Chanwana, Tuna Ilimishana. Na leo, tukopa juya uh, biashara ama bongo la biashara. E, Niti hivo bongo la biashara. Atakwa tunabonga story ya vile. Hakuna employment. Eh yeah, squeezy employment uh, kidogo kidogo ime, imechenga wase so wacha tuone vile hii internet na mnet inaweza katusaidia uh, tunini inaweza katusaidia kujijenga kijamii unajua si lazima tu kumechorwa wera ama pengine kapi umechorwa wera uh, niko na mamentors watakuwa natuambia more about online and e-commerce online and uh, internet businesses and e-commerce cryptocurrency nimesikia kuna ile inaitwa hivyo yes and I will put other stuff so jaribu kudondoka this is uh, chanuka dada with me selina njoki the brown girl brown that is that and right about now introducing boys avenue you known as despacito 67 year old Philip David Charles Collins yes an English drummer singer songwriter multi instrumentalist record producer and actor yes and he's fading out there with that chino and as another day in paradise playing right here only on Kenya's number one get to radio 89.5 and this is Chanuka Dada with me Selina Njoki the brown girl brown that is a doctor and Leo yes I'm uh, privileged to host guests in the studio niko now again iko nyesti studio ah uh, ambao watakuwa natupigia story ama wanatu eh, wanatuchanua sana sana kuhusu story ya online businesses e-commerce uh, cryptocurrency na blockchain technology hizi ni vitu maybe uko hapo mtaani hujachorwa job na mtu ama ujui uh, form ni gani but uh, kuna vile unaweza jisaidia ukiwa na simu yako tu kwa hao and uh, you know what I what I teach you more so i will start with you dada mambo poa <laughs> sana mambo fiti sana uh-huh. uh, maybe you can start by telling people unaitwa nani yeah i'm um, christine tito by name uh-huh. uh a youth a kenyan youth single um. <laughs> it doesn't matter I anyway. Mean, that. <laughs> right. Okay, yes, I am a lawyer by profession, mm-hmm. uh, but an entrepreneur by choice. So yes, I know what it means to have a degree but not to depend on it. Okay. I know what it means uh, not to depend on a job. So unataka so. kusema uko na degree ya law lakini <laughs> si to me <laughs> to me <laughs> yes yani au uandiki au hujachorwa job na mtu hujachorwa job na mtu ni mambo ya kujichora mimi mwenyewe eh yes okay through easy ma <laughs> story to the internet some ma jobs through the internet. internet and i have no regrets sawa sawa <laughs> and you mr gentleman sema mjeshi mambo kwa sababu leo ni birthday yako happy birthday yes karibia speaker kidogo i mean the microphone rather kidogo yes and then you can introduce yourself okay my name is Charles Okuku mm-hmm. a blogger by profession and a crypto entrepreneur a blogger and a crypto entrepreneur, entrepreneur. Yes. sawa sawa so blogger crypto entrepreneur yeah um pia uja chorwa na mtu kazi uko job kivi yako and yeah. uh, you know I, I depend on my blogging stuff mm-hmm. to make a living mm-hmm. and uh, blogging is white mm-hmm. yeah blogging is why do yes all right so basically unaweza tuambia maybe christine tunaweza tunaweza anza na christine yes christine unaweza tuambia story ya blockchain yeah you ni nini na utuambie na ile language si tu understand okay blockchain technology is simply a uh, the safest technology that the world has discovered to store to receive and to send anything of value. So unataka kumaanisha banka ziwezi. Uh, zinaweza <laughs> zikatai, you know. Uh-huh. But unaona ile hustle ya kwenda nitembe nitoke hapa niende hadi kwa bank to verify is this okay is this not. Uh-huh. You can easily do it on your phone. Yes. Not just storing money but anything of value. I mean certificates, but certificates. I mean uh, land title deeds, anything yenye unaona utahitaji for the rest of your life utahitaji hizo documents. Uh-huh. You know and you want the value 
valid document for that matter. Yeah, so blockchain technology is here to cover that generally. Okay, sasa ni kama tuseme mm. in short acha tu niulize ka tu mtu wa juu ama kimanda zimanda zini kama mm. uh, vile si uko na hard disk mm-hmm. unaeka mziki ama flash disk mm-hmm. unaeka mziki mm-hmm. so in short nasema blockchain ni kitu kama hiyo let me show you unaona venye sasa the difference kama wewe uko na pesa in cash mm. na uko na pesa kwa mpesa mm. okay you see the digits on your phone na unaamini kweli hii ni pesa na ukienda nao kwa shop you can sell yeah. you can nunua anything yeah. using the money yeah. it's the same now oh. it's a wallet like that you have it on you it's a wallet you store anything but the good thing is it does not store money only mm. it stores anything of value anything any document that you want to keep unaweza pia na example christine yes pia na example kitana certificate eh those are all the things that are of value Now the thing na zaongelea ni you see the government sai venye kumekuwa na issue ya land land issues mm-hmm. especially lamo yeah. unakuta the same title deed ni konayo the same title deed uko nayo the same title deed someone else akona so you cannot verify ni nani yeah, ana own yes mm-hmm. so now the government has decided to take that issue to blockchain technology mm-hmm. so that to copy all that data into a system where it is permanent now this is simply a permanent system where you cannot alter or change any thing that has been put there it gives us the transparency it are reduce mambo na corruption and yeah, stuff kweli, because kweli. yeah if i sell you the land i cannot sell it again to someone else mm-hmm. it will show on my system so basically yes so hiyo ndio inaitwa je blockchain technology, technology. yes haya cryptocurrency <laughs> cryptocurrency simply comes from uh, breaking cryptocurrency into two crypto and currency crypto simply means digital or soft okay. currency simply means money, money. Yes. So now cryptocurrency unajua tumekuwa tukitumia digital currency na tujui Mpesa ni digital money. Yes, yes because, because you cannot touch it but you can use it. Mm. Yes, so this is why we're talking about cryptocurrency. Now the difference with cryptocurrency generally is that it is not centralized, it is not owned by a government, it is worldwide. Okay. What am I talking about? Ninasema ile pesa niko nayo on cryptocurrency Kenya, the same person anaweza tumia UK or US. I don't need like to change it ikiwa Kenyan money mm. nikienda Uganda ni change into Ugandan, Ugandan money. money oh you yes. can use this at as, a, as a universal yeah, currency it's universal currency okay okay yes. Yes. na hii ndio bado bitcoin sijui bitcoin no. <laughs> <laughs> i expected that question you see people hear about cryptocurrency the yeah, first the thing first that th- comes into their minds bitcoin me, bitcoin <laughs> uh, bitcoin is just one of the currencies oh. but under it there are more there's something like ethereum there's Bitcoin. Bitcoin cash there are so many there are over 5000 and they are all currencies they are all money but digital money eh hey, okay sawa <laughs> sawa at least tume understand hapo yes, yes. at least tume understand na nime learn kitu mpya yeah. in a little while tunakuja kuongea na Charles atuambie more about uh, uh, you know e-commerce how people can do business online otherwise uh, say my name by destiny's child right about now at 22 minutes past 11 o'clock eh, kama uko na swali yote please make sure ume interact na sisi kwenye Geto Radio Facebook fan page Geto Radio 89.5 Twitter handle is Geto Radio 895 at Brongia late 95 hashtag chanuka dada All right, I'm Maroon 5 fading out there with that you known as a one more night. Yes, and it's 30 minutes past 11 o'clock. Kumbuka niko na guest kwenye studio and it's all about biashara ya kisasa. Wacha ile ya kitambo, eh zile za kitambo wa TOSG uh, atuwezi eh, biashara lazima ku pia umechorwa na mtu ama kitu kama hiyo. You know, we are doing it digital this time around and we have a special guest in the studio, uh, the youth mentors promoting e-commerce uh, digital currencies a blockchain technology cryptocurrencies and your digital currency ndipo tumeambiwa leo and we have Christine and Charles Okuku in the studio Charles welcome yes yes uh, karibu tena sana sana haya wewe story yako ndio umetuambia kwanza happy birthday nimerudi nimesema mara ya pili haya so um e-commerce ni nini e-commerce the word e-commerce is the word e mm-hmm. the letter e means electronic electronic e-commerce, e-commerce the word commerce means business, b- business yeah. yeah so it's it's like e-business yani electronic e- business yeah electronic business mm-hmm. so e-commerce the definition of e-commerce the simple one is the selling and the buying of goods and services through the use of internet 
Okay, through the in, the use of internet. Yes. All right. Sawa so, sawa. So, Sasa so, so, okay, quick question. Nyi ndio mnaandika ngapo sijui how do you want to get rich? Do you want to go Facebook ushe ingia? Ushe 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 ka post. Alafu kidogo tu unasikia mtu ameanza do you do you want to do you want to au ni hawa ni yeye ama ni nani? Funny thing enough. Yeah, unapata Facebook imeja do you want to know how to make, make 5000 yes. in a week and what and what and what. Alafu wame photoshop pictures. I know, zao. I know. I, I've actually <laughs> gone gone to such platforms because I was like is it real? Yeah. That is not what we do. Okay. That is not what we do because what we do is international. What we do is very very new. It has just come in. That's why at wewe you you have learned today what yeah. is blockchain technology. Yes. Yeah, so this is not a thing I'll call you for on Facebook like come make no. Okay. Yes. You find that uh, these people are flooding Facebook with such kind of stuff that uh, you know you can make like this amount of money mm. just in a week. Mm. Am I in a day? This people, you can't even see them like uh, face to face. Uh, I find that they only write on our our post as a blogger when oh, I yeah. put an article and it goes viral online. Mm. They, they they come there in the comment section and then they they post their their stuff and it's just copy pasted. They they use the same 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 uh, word or uh, line. Every everyone yeah every everybody day. and then they go to uh, the big people the the big people who are, who are followers online. Yeah. They they go to their the comment sections. They publish then they. They, they they copy and paste everything there. Kwa hivyo hiyo business yenu si hiyo. Ama ile business no, no. tunaongelea leo si hiyo. No. Hata ikaribii. Our people they empower the world eh. how they can use e-commerce to earn a living. So having to depend on employment. Give us give us like a, a real life example ya yeah, e-commerce. Yeah, e-commerce maybe kitu tushaifanya ama kitu yes. tunaonanga na okay. vile tu alituambia story ya yeah. digital money yes. pesa uko nayo kwa simu si tu tunajua hiyo ndio hiyo ni cryptocurrency yes. lakini zaidi tumejua so ebu tuambie tu basically like give an example yes i can use my facebook page mm-hmm. to post uh, maybe I, um, i want to sell my phone mm-hmm. or any stuff that i have mm-hmm. i simply take a good picture of the of the stuff of the, the product yeah. and then i publish it on my page mm. and then na sema nini na naweka hapo nini details that the description naweka naweka price hey. na kuku location naweka namba yangu pia hey. then i boost it i can boost it or i can just post it if i have enough followers people will see it i will get response from people mm. and i will get potential customers Okay so and we can just exchange the money online and I simply deliver the product. Okay so it's not a master ti eh biashara ti kwe ni biashara kubwa. No sasa lazima kuwe na shop. Ati I can, run, shop. I can run everything through the use of my phone. Oh. Just, just my phone. Then let me say I have my website. You contact me as a blogger, you want to promote something. I simply write about that uh, story of yours, mm. maybe you are selling something or a service. I put it on my blog. And then you pay me for that. That's oh, all right. Yes, no. That's e-commerce. You you don't even have to meet me, you don't even have to see me, you don't even have to sit down. You simply send me money via e- you simply send e money. I receive it. There are so many ways you can send e money to any part of the world. Okay. Yes. And uh, you being a blogger now, it, uh, is it easier for you ni raisi kwako kufanya hizi biashara hiyo kama biashara kama hiyo? Juu unajua mm-hmm. si ati pia mimi ni shay by kitu lakini sikubai online hivyo directly vile wewe yes. umeweka. Yeah. Mimi niliona ni mjamaa ameweka kitu nime like nime like hizo earphones. Yes. Uh, alafu nikampigia niko na hizo details nikampigia nikwambia ni aje mm-hmm. uh, ni hook up na hizo ni hook up na hizo earphones. Yes. Kidogo si ameleta ame uh, nimezichukua. Yes and uh, akuko asikuogopa atio hakuna security hakuna mm. kitu kama hiyo hakuna uh, kitu kama i mean ati sijaletewa ama hazijakuja mm. so uh, as a blogger maybe <clears throat> do you find it easier for you to run shop evo yeah you uh, as a blogger i find it very easy to, to do that because you have followers what if mtu hana followers well uh, if you don't have followers You can use those who are followers <laughs> to reach the customers that you want. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. Labda ni break down a bit yeah, yeah. Okay. using another example. You see Sayuki sinja hapa. Hautahitaji kwenda supermarket ama kupikiwa na mtu yeyote. You can just go to inaitwa vipi? Inaitwa 
Uh, the app mm. the, the app ye, ye, ya ku order chakula wataletea yes. hapa hapa hivi mm-hmm. you see the youth we must not we must not wait for such opportunities to pite you can just create enough for yourself to say hey i deliver food i deliver tops i deliver this and this you mm. know just using your phone you just make a market for yourself you do not need anybody you start with your new friends mm. ninafanya hivi na hivi nisaidieni kuambia wengine mm. pia ninafanya hivi don't sit and wait Wow. Yes. So it's that easy. It's that easy. Eh, hey, tunakuja kuendelea hii debate hapa. After hii ziki ya Gladys Knight, I hope you dance all wanna come through kwenye Geto Radio Facebook fan page. Big up yourself. I see you Boniwa at the River. Good morning to you. Peter Sandiki, Wero Paul Hiram Karambo there. I see you and uh, also uh Iman James and I'm following from Mombasa. I hope you dance Sister Gladys Knight. I Fidel Williams fading out there with that chin. Yeah, if Fidel Williams fading out with that you know as I think in out loud originally done by um Ed Sheeran <laughs> originally done by Ed Sheeran kidogo ilikuwa imetoka and it's playing right here only on Kenya's number one get ready 89.5 macho big up yourself yes you listening to show na inakubamba ati nikukembe vile nakukemba tu sawa macho big up yourself you listening online on www.getradio.co.ke big up yourself Idol Africa also tuning to the show and loving it about mm, super lady super lady Zara i hope uh, unapata hizo matiching so kiwa hapa isili Dion why shoes na sema hapo sawa teachings necessary kabisa eh, wacha wacha watu wacharuliwe kusu hizi mabiashara uh, mpisa ya kabeti na kukemo unasema morning tune alongside my dad even son gitao mameri wanjohe brodeni so wainaina na karo eh, karoshi alvin hehona edward kimani wagutike tena kwa sana otherwise this is a chanuka dada with me selina njoki the brown girl brown that's a doctor and we're talking about uh, online businesses e-commerce a cryptocurrency I'm a digital currency blockchain technology yani sasa hizi watu wameamua eh uh, wata deal sana sana na nini na vitu uh, vitu vitu modern yani vitu za kisasa hizi vitu zingine za kitambo za kwa mka asubuhi kwenda gikomba sijui lazima biashara mtu amke urauke five ura uende sijui wapi uchukue sijui nini a a hizo sasa ziko karibu kuchorewa juu ya hizi online businesses so uh, maybe Christine unaweza tuambia how did you start and well why are you here today <laughs> see mm-hmm. um like an, any other african or any other kenyan eh? mm-hmm. tunazaliwa tunapelekwa shuleni tunaambwa eh usome upate degree nzuri siju ndo upate kazi siju ndo ufanye nini which is is not bad mm-hmm. it is okay it is fine but uh, you agree with me kule kenya imefika sasa hivi hatuwezi tegemea uh, kazi hatuwezi tegemea kazi you know so um even those people with degrees mm. utapata wengi wako tu huku huku tu why because they were so focused on your degree yenye yako nayo yenye hana otherwise mm. so you find yourself taking CVs here taking CVs there taking at the end of the day you're so frustrated with yourself and love your self esteem yako inaenda chini we kama dem for example unaanza kufanya fanya vitu zingine zenye hazifai mm. you know because us as ladies na Mungu ametuumba na ile a way of giving mm. we are givers by nature unasikia ngatu hata mtaki kuja kwako heri ya kunywe maji kama hakuna Like yeah, it, so, you know. yes so you find that when you do not have something to give mm. you you strain yourself to get something mm. you become desperate so that's where we get lost mm. so i'm here today for the youth i'm here today for the ladies to show them there's something you can do without that degree needing it or there's something you can do during your part time hata kama una kazi to increase your income i have done it and uh, it is working for me so i feel it could work for anybody else you know you're making it sound so easy it is easy uh, uh, you're making it sound so easy and so real i mean so 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 okay so nice mpaka yes. nashindua kwani kwa nini tumelalisha watu wamelalisha hey, ina niuma ina niuma because tuko focused sana kwa the, the ile system ile automatic system niamuke mapema niende nifanye hivi because lazima ni hasol eh, lazima ni hasol nili nilifunzwa hivi mm. no go out of your way do something unique you see you cannot always do the same thing and expect a different result mm. you must do something extraordinary to get something extraordinary so wo ukisema hizo story hizo ma business ah mm. uh, uangali market ya kenya sana unaangalia mpaka market ya international, international market yes. so what can you do 
what what kind of businesses for example uh the entire market has lots of things to do you can trade from whichever side you feel like trade you say i cannot train everyone like yeah, Harper, yeah, because it yeah, will yeah. take me the nah, whole day yeah yeah but um any field that kuna field and you takosa market online hakuna kule utakosa market online if it's clothes unaweza iuza bila kuhitaji any 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 market na hapo hakuna mabroker hakuna mabroker ni wewe na huyo mwenye unauzia you know all you need is is bundles maybe it's a 30 bob yeah there are seven things that one can do online to generate a good income okay that seven things where so imagine That's a lot of opportunities. Yes. Online Now, is big. Okay, coming back to you Charles, eh? Yes. Um security. Yeah. Security wale watu wanafanya kazi business. Yaani ni online yani. Uh what kind of faith? Yaani sema tu hivyo ama what matter of faith? Yenye naweza kuwa nayo mimi sikujui. Yes. Lakini na naamini hii ni kibai hii bairo kwako nitapata. Haya usiponiuzia Unless ni kuanike kwa Kilimani mama sama sijeni kuanike wapi <laughs> ndio kupeleka ndio kupeleka polisi gani ama ndio ku, what is the security like well, in the world of e-commerce uh-huh. we have three things very important to consider before you start any any business to do with online uh-huh. number one, you require skills number two, you require a mentor someone who will take you through how it works uh-huh. in, in and out uh-huh. and then number three, you require an e-commerce platform where will you be working where will you be operating whether you have the laptop there you have your phone there where will you be working once you are on your phone where are you going to be working mm. e-commerce platform so with it, with e-commerce platform you need to know the the platform where it is located or the leaders of that e-commerce platform platform can be a social media Uh, a social media uh, platform it can be your own website it can be someone sells a uh, uh, website mm. so long as it gives you that opportunity it links you with the market with the market yes. sawa sawa sijakata uko na hizo zote mimi ni customer nataka kununua maybe bairo kwako hii bairo nataka kununua sasa niko sure aje nikikulipa uta deliver Aya, niko sure je ushaona zile sijui kwa ushaona post zingine kwa Facebook mtu aliitisha nguo nguo ikakuja sijui na kaji itarudi true. ama itafanya nini Okay in the world of e-commerce we also need to be honest you have to, you have to, you have to deal with So we are dealing with uh, faith yani hatuko yeah. sure kama kitu itakuwa nini itakuwa delivered ama kama kutakuwa na nini ama kama kama italetwa ile kitu nimeorder kama italetwa Ebu ni umwenu ni kitu jumia Mm. and it came mm. so before anyone or any company goes to start such a business they must have kind of a qualification to be there okay, okay. yes so there are people watching all right yes there is an authority watching such that i cannot go away with your money oh. okay yes okay. yes you your, qualifi- your qualification lazima iwe because hata tukisema hivyo you see we are all we are all africans and tunajua how opportunities come mm. people can take such an opportunity to misuse it yeah. it has worked not once not twice unakuta he niliorder hii haikuwa ikuja because we mwenyewe haukufanya research ya kujua is this genuine or not kwa hivyo unatupatia tena kazi nyingine ya kufanya research you must know where your money is going oh, yeah. to i mean you're working for it mm. so just don't throw away money mm. this is why we are here we are here to coach people how do you know this is genuine mm. how do you know this will work for you how will you know this is yeah so no, that's why we are here today Yes. Okay, sawa sawa. Second because, hour. Hmm? Because everything deals with money, my friend. Oh yeah, true, true yeah. that. Eh, na pali pesa inatajwa mimi kwa za mupenda. Second hour na kufuatia chance ni dungia na 07 au to dungia on 0711443886 right about now introducing Billy Ocean the chino on as suddenly on a sunny Sunday. Yes, it's already five minutes past 12 o'clock. Good afternoon. Yes, from Kenya's number one Gator Radio 89.5. You're listening to us on air and online www.gatorradio.co.ke and on TV, the visual radio, gatorradio.co.ke slash TV. Member say you need to download Pia Gator Radio app. I love to keep my mind on the phone. I love to keep my mind on the phone. I love to keep my mind on the phone.
<laughs> and uh, we are talking about uh, our online businesses, uh, cryptocurrency, blockchain tech, yes, uh, and uh, e-commerce. Yani hii ni vitu kumbe si ufanya na zimekuwa majina kubwa kubwa hapa lakini tunajaribu uh, kunini tunajaribu kuzi kuelezewa vizuri na Christine and Charles. Uh, Christine Tito and uh, Charles Okoku. Eh uh, wamekam ni my youth mentors promoting e-commerce. Eh uh, naona wakimba hapa kwenye Get Radio 89.5. Abed ni kampeni amani na kukemba big up yourself you listening and co tuned eh, from Machakos unasema show inaweza same na filo yule mna ule mna stipa si eh, pamoja na filo okay na Georges Musembithe eh, anambia hashtag chanuka dada locked Zack Zion wakina big up yourself brother and thank you for tuning in uh, same way na wale watoto wana come through wakina Haron and Jima Albert Mboro Kirito pamoja na eh, Hiram Kanambode I see you too thank you very much for tuning in Otherwise you can call us up on 0711443886 eh kama uko na swali yote kwa wageni wangu otherwise tukiendelea na history bado Uh Christine maybe you can tell us more on how the government government inachukuliaje hiki kitu government inachukuliaje hiki kitu ama ni kidogo tu sikie tena tumerushwa unajua ati wameona tunatengeneza pesa sana na hii nini na hii mboka alafu kidogo wasikia imesha kwa kiwenwa ya singine the first question ili expect si jumbo umekawia nayo lazima tungeenda step by step lazima tungeenda step by step lakini sawa now before ni kujibu hiyo swali mm. kuna vitu tatu mimi huambia mtu yeyote mwenye anafanya anything online if you're not sure of anything you are doing online these are the three things unafaa kujua number one, legality is it legal when it is legal you have no doubt automatically mm. number two, the foundation what do i mean by the foundation ni nani ameileta ukishajua nani ameileta utajua amekuwa akifanya nini before afanye hii mm. na ukishajua alikuwa anafanya nini uta verify if what they've been doing is successful so if what they've been doing is successful of course this one cannot fail and number mm. three, is the market mm. nikikwambia now there is a company called this and this so come you become a shareholder utakunapata hii pesa kwa mwaka sijui kwa siku sijui kwa nini hebu jiulize hii pesa ninatoa inaenda kuuza nini ama inaenda ku trade wapi because it has to trade something to give you a return if it is not trading anything then it is not genuine because hii pesa inatoka wapi ninarudi kwako ndo unapata money laundering yes <laughs> not even laundering una una enter into something because beshte yako wako hey. alafu at the end of the day unakuta in one month or two hakuna anything ime ime imeisha imepotea pesa yako yote imepotelea ndani so hizo vitu tatu lazima u verify mm. no talking about blockchain na the government utapata like um the land issue yenye inafanyika the towards the coast side yeah mm-hmm. unapata government sai wameamua to put the land documents into blockchain technology because they know this is the safest the safest place they can put something yeah in the most transparent uh platform ya ku store anything yenye ita benefit wa Kenya so the government is already there okay the government is already there kwa hivyo si kitu ati ya ya uongo uongo ni watu tu ndio bado hawajapata information okay. that's why we are here to inform you to Now, run with time if you say that uh, if you say story ya kuweka maybe title deed kwa hiyo nini kwa hiyo nini blockchain. kwa hiyo blockchain mm. does it mean uh, siku ile mimi nataka kubai land mm nitauziwa tu bado kwa hiyo blockchain ama what will happen let me show you the thing is ya yeah, unapata unataka kununua gari ya 10 million mm. hautahitaji wakili you just you just buy okay but ukitaka land ya hata 50k pekee you must need a lawyer there because mm. you you not sure of the transparency who really owns it they must verify this for us so with this blockchain technology hai inatoa hao watu wengi the third parties hapo inakupea sasa the buyer and the seller nitaenda tu kwa simu yangu niangalie this land number what and what it is not sold it is in the market i click and buy it that's simple wow which means blockchain technology came to uh, solve a solution All right, came to solve a solution namba ni watu wametoka kuomboka sasa. <laughs> <laughs> Mabroka watakula nini? <laughs> anyway, lakini it's a, it's a good it's a good thing. I think it's a good thing because uh, uh, kuna makantri zingine zinafanya hii kazi na ina work. Yeah. Kuna makantri wame embrace hii block technology na ina in work. You see Uganda tu hapa tusiende mbali. Yeah. Uganda already uh, they have the mining site for uh, cryptocurrency already in maybe two to three years watakuwa natumia cash alafu pia selling tunaweza kuona example huko Lambo in India mm. there is a machine 
that if you want to do weeding in the garden, the machine you set it everything and then you say only weeds. Mm. Don't put my eh. crops. Eh. Then you throw them. throw them. Zina toa weed kabisa uitaji kuingia kwa shamba. They do everything for you. The uh, is clean. <laughs> <laughs> it's called technology. Uh, technology yes, naweza. <laughs> uh, but uh, sasa wakisema hivyo okay itapatia kila mtu opportunity pia ya kuan. Yes. Either way vile tu bado watu watatoka juu ju, saa kama ma, watu wa weed ama mm. mimi si watu wa weed. <laughs> <laughs> Nimeiputi kaka viba. <laughs> I know. Ah <laughs> uh, wale watu wanafanya kazi ya weeding kwa shamba. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, that's why people say that uh, the technology is uh, uh, shading out the employment. Yaani watu wana kazi naisha juu chenye chenye mtu akifanya na mkono mm. inafanywa na mashini okay and uh, all right we'll come back and talk about maybe the future the future of block uh, uh, blockchain technology and uh, e-commerce uh, cryptocurrency pia and uh, pia uh, kuna history ya wase au si wambia mtu kuja ati at is due e e tunmonge about our watu first hour mm-hmm. but uh, tuku elaborate kila kitu yes. ulikuwa unasema story nilikuwa nasema story ya initwaje pyramid schemes mm. yes. kuna difference yes there is a difference unakumbuka nikikwambia the three things you should look oh, yes. at before you get into anything online mm. now what people miss is the number three, the market Do not enroll into anything because mtu amekwambia kuja uta make money in a week. Hiyo pesa inatoka wapi jamani? Okay, okay. Inatoka wapi? Lazima you have that uh, the facts on tips like mm. ada wewe kuwa, kuwa, kuwa genuine na yourself. Mazi. Ninaingia kwa hii ninaambiwa nitapata pesa kwa wiki hakuna kenye i company nauza hakuna kenye ninafanya ni kuita tu watu what kind of business is that that's a scheme yes alafu pia lazima uangalie kwamba kuna service gani ama kuna product gani utakuwa unauza kwa hiyo platform kwa hiyo company mm. at whether you are doing it online or offline lazima uangalie kuna product gani <laughs> so what's <so>, up? Uh, <laughs> introducing the new exclusive new music. Uh, this one is uh, by Gashago. In yes, uh, uh, known as music uh new as Niwewe. Yes, playing right here only on Kenya's number one get radio it's 9.5. Red Sun fading out there with that you known as uh, eh, Julie mziki ya kitambo kidogo <laughs> and uh, sasa hizi vile tunaenda digital live bado kuna mziki anatoa you know these are the artists of the time eh, send by for some darling p with the you known as four in one coming right up after this particular talk break i don't know if you remember that one uh, but then uh, this is Chanuka Dada only on Kenya's number one get radio 89.5 you with me Selina Njoki the Brown Yal Brown the doctor with the very amazing hosts eh, very very amazing host and my mentor wa easy my programs are com- uh, the online businesses the youth mentors are pro- mentors program are promoting promoting rather e-commerce uh, and uh, you know online businesses tuko na Charles Okuku pamoja na Christine Tito and uh, you know amekuwa kitueleza story mingi sana about easy stories are uh, blockchain technology cryptocurrency na e-commerce Maria Wamboya na sawa blockchain technology and e-commerce explain in the simplest way possible congratulations to Christine Tito and Charles Okuku meskia haya mm-hmm. so, <laughs> thank you mpesa ya kawete tenje imetengenezwa unaweza piga 0711443886 alafu brayo wa marisha i see you in saningo nkoruma anasema information is key to everything congratulations uh, to this business leaders uh, for the great work they're doing Christine and Charles you love the no limits I mean ni kumpenda wani big up yourself hashtag Chanuka Dada na simu uko locked and tuned in all the way from Machakos eh alafu Benja amai chako Kingston ako locked or filo ko potuko pamoja ah kuna msi hapa alikuwa ametumia text anasemaje easy ma crypto 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 whatever ni, ni scam goja not after your comment ina come samuel kirek i see you as hard work pays to all the youth zak zayan wakinyo i see you and uh on you haron and jema haron jema na samaje is a crypto system mob ni scams very true mob ni scam because people get into it not knowing what you're getting into exactly sawa sawa yeah. it is not the crypto itself has been there Mm-hmm. ever since it mm. has been there but people take advantage of what they know to fool those who do not know 
how for example how if i know about crypto technology mm. and you do not know anything so anything i tell you you will believe ba eh kama sasa hizi miamini zile zote tunaambia na kwa nini unaweza kuona ningiza sijui so the thing is ya yeah, as a create two site yangu mimi mwenyewe a temporary site that is what happens basically okay. i create a temporary site and then i have this knowledge and then inaita watu niwaambia oh this is this and then you feel the idea is so enticing mm. and then you're into it after some time i lock down my system because i've already got any money so the idea is real but i'm just taking advantage of it kufool watu kuchukua pesa zao so it's not like crypto itself is fake it is very real but people use it people use it to vibaya. make vibaya yes mm-hmm. to make money mm-hmm. now um i needed to co- talk about it by the way hata kama hunge uliza because anyone who gets into crypto day one hata mimi mwenyewe sikuwa na positivity ndani yake like i was so sure hata <laughs> tuniende nisikize is scam mm-hmm. but the truth is mtu huwa hakatai mwito mtu katal itu yeah itu walo so i went there <laughs> siku njema <I> had... <laughs> Yes, I had about what I was taught. I went and did my research. I'm into it. I have done it and it is working for me. The thing is we just do not know how to go about it. The reason why I am here. I want to show you how to go about it the right way. Mm. Nimepoteza pesa online by the way. See one sit twice. <laughs> Sasa I've been hapo. a victim. Okay. I've been a victim yes, but I never got tired of trying. Why? Because at some point I was focused. I knew nimepoteza ndio but kuna kitu mahali I'm not doing right. So when I got it right, I'm on the right track. You are sure? I am on this. Do you want to join me mimi? Thank you later. <laughs> And then, do you like have uh, when you want to trade vitu kama hizo ma bitcoins na nini you have to invest. Yes. yes, you have to invest because how will you sell what you do not have? Oh, see, cause you mean, you <laughs> no, you must you own it. I own it. So whenever I wish I, w- I want to sell it, I just sell it. So I you must own it first. Okay. okay. Yes. You want to operate. You must invest. There's okay. no way you can uh, do business without okay. investing. Yes. All right. So, so I'm going to maybe probably the future. Yeah, the future mm. of uh, crypto and uh, blockchain technology. Mm. Anyone who watches news for the past two months, TV mekwa to cryptocurrency, mekwa to blockchain technology, cryptocurrency, blockchain technology. Actually, that is why I am here today because it is new in our country. I have a feeling this is the time the youth can take this opportunity and run with. Yes, this is an opportunity for us the youth. We are the ones to learn about it so very fast so that we teach the world about it. Okay. Yes. And uh, why kwa nini hizi vitu zote zimeshikanishwa? Kwa nini mtu hizi fanya ama kwa nini hazijabreakiwa down into kama ni e-commerce peke yake, mm. kama ni crypto peke yake, blockchain peke yake, zote from oh, so, oh, sorry. Uh, zote ziko zote, zote mshikanisha pamoja. Yes. Mm. We we started by saying blockchain technology is a digital technology. So since it is a digital technology that you use online, you must have digital currency to go with it. Okay. Yes, oh. because it is global. It oh. is worldwide. Oh. All right, yes, all right. So, so, actually, you may understand. Focus. One can focus on cryptocurrency alone and make money. One can focus on e-commerce alone and make mm-hmm. money. One so they are different entities all yes. together. Yes. But all tena moja okay <laughs> oh they are all under blockchain, blockchain technology, technology yes. ah now i understand <laughs> now cryptocurrency uh, it started like uh, way back uh, in 2009 mm. that's that's the first time that we had the first coin which is called bitcoin mm-hmm. that's the coin that majority knows but we have over a thousand other coins so when if when you look at the history of bitcoin you'll find that when it started in 2009 it was very very affordable Nine years down the line What is the value right now? 10 bob last year December moja tu ilikuwa 1.9 million. Hey, kuna watu walidura hiyo time. Wait. One bitcoin was just about 10 bob. Yeah. Less than 50 bob actually. Uh, uh, In last year 2017 towards December One Bitcoin was 1.7 M Kenya shillings. Tunarudi. Right now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, 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 I don't know the value. That is why I'm asking what is the value. <laughs> okay, uh, you. Uh, <laughs> okay, you're coming back after this 10 for in one dialing P0711443886 na unasimu by the way. Hello. Okay. Imekatika but 0711443886. Hello get a radio. Hey, Jackie. Hey, niaje? 
mambo. Oh, asana niambie. Zakzayo na papa. Eh, hey, Zakzayo mm. nasikia umechanuka leo ya kweli? Eh, hey, leo nimechanuka sana nasikia tu mdogo mdogo tu vile na channel hiyo vile anaanza kabisa na kangu ni wafungulie kasupa. Wafungulie kasupa kusuka kwa nini? Wafungulie kasupa kwa mneti. Kwa mneti sana huko kinewa kwa na bayon line. Hapo sawa. Kwa sana. Mhm. Nafikiri tuje tuje na give thanks na respect kwa wa wa youth men huko. Ehe. Wale kan kuna ile ya ya chanuki ya kinelisa ni kadada. Okay, kina nani? Paipa Madre. Kadel bila kesi kasi ni mtu mtaji ya chuma mikile kilafu tukiwa tama make mpesa kabete na kikuyu na kibeta kwenye mtingu na dimi ya tano kadada Ok, sawa sawa, thank you Welcome Alright Eh umeambiwa umegutewa sana uwe nataka kuanzisha eh supermarket yake online. We wish you well Eh pale kino Zack Zion big up yourself Kleptomaniacs tune on as uh, Swing Swing uh, playing right here only on Kenya's number one. Get to Radio 89.5 on this particular Sunday. Yeah, so we are talking about uh, cryptocurrency. Yani nimesikia story hapa mpaka nikachoka. Bitcoin ilianza ikiwa na 10 bob. Yeah? Yes. <laughs> Bitcoin ilianza ikiwa na 10 bob in 2009. Yes. Alafu sasa hizi inatoka how much? 600k. Yenye mbona 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 mko mnatuchanua hizi vitu mapema hata ningebaiza thao wala <laughs> sisi tulidhani ni scam hiyo time you know yeah. ile belief ya yeah, this thing is not working it eh. is not working and now hapo ndo selfishness ya watu wanatake advantage because by the time it gets to us we mm. cannot afford it oh yes, yes kama mimi nimesikia vibaya sana juu ningebai tu hata za punch ningebai tu hata za punch ningesikia vibaya 2009 eh mtu angesikia vibaya yani always is Usingi sikia ni kata nimekoniwa. Mimi si kujua. Mimi nimekuja kusikia story ya Bitcoin 2015 hapo mm. 2016. Then you bought it on about in 2014, 2014, 2015. Now. And then uh, juu watu walikuwa wame go through vitu kama zile pyramid scheme yes. hizo. Yes. Uh, watu bado walikuwa very very skeptical. Hakuna yes. mtu alikuwa anajisikia mm. ati kuni ni kuingililia ama kufanya 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 hiyo business. Exactly. So umesema hizo nini eh, zinakuwa zinakuwa hizo shares ama Ah uh, hizo bitcoin zinabaiwa. Yes. Mtu kama saizi maybe anajitambua anaweza buy wapi? Online aje as in uh, how do you how do they trade? We have platforms. Mm-hmm. Each and every country in this entire world has platforms. Uh, kuna kama local bitcoin yenyiko almost in every country. Mm-hmm. Kuna Remitano and then we have merchants. Mm-hmm. Merchants are traders. Mm-hmm. So if you go to 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 any platform you find that in Kenya wamekuletea hawa na hawa hawa wanauza. Okay. And they are very genuine because they are being monitored as well like I told you. Oh, yeah. So hakuna siku utasema oh nimepeka pesa yangu sijui sijapata bitcoin mm-hmm. we've been trading daily and something beauty about bitcoin is that you find that when you want to buy from someone it's a peer to peer it's from me to you it's mm-hmm. you to me there's nothing like it's going to someone third party but si kuna traders ama sijasikia traders mahali you could be a trader yourself if oh. you have them yeah. mm-hmm. okay that's why tunataka people to come and learn we cannot do all the explaining here all right yeah. right yeah it's, it's a big field yeah it's a big field and pia inachanganisha juu kidogo karibu ni changanikiwe unapata kwa sahi bitcoin tuko na ATM hapa Kenya mm. Islands tu mm. ATM ya bitcoin na kadi ilotoa wapi hiyo ya nini same way you go with your card from this eh. or, or mastercard eh. withdraw your cash eh. the same way you can go with your blockchain wallet that you have the bitcoin and withdraw what Bitcoin now. Where do you get that card? Do you get it from the merchants now and it's not a card. It's uh, just blockchain. It's okay. just a it's wallet. Oh, it's still okay. They just do the scanning of your ID, the the uh, the blockchain ID like yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah and then the transaction comes. Okay. Hakuna kubeba chochote. Iwe card iwe nini simu tu. find that transaction cost ni kidogo sana. Transaction cost. Compared to kutuma pesa kwa mtu through other means. Okay. Kwa bank ama kwa ile simu mobile. Pia hapa cost ni kidogo sana. Hiyo ndio inaitwa kuchanuliwa. Sasa leo ndio tumechanuliwa kabisa. Hello 7114388886. Hello get radio. Hello. Mimi niko on hold vibaya tena sana. <laughs> And um all right, tukoje kuongea about maybe tumonge about future. 
Talking about future, about uh, the future of uh, you know all these uh, blockchain technology. Ni seme at jiongeta kamkonge about uh, the future and watu uh, nesa chanuliwa mo kuna summit mnafanya on Thursday at All Saints Cathedral. So kama nesa make kumkufika po iwo one amuski mo about ni ni historia blockchain kwa kwa serious. Please make sure mfika po All Saints Cathedral on uh, on Thursday, 13th of September at 2 p.m. Hello, get your radio. Yes, brand girl. Ya jinsia wanaokolea ngama hii kama nikao ndai kwanza business ama azini kama kukupatia kaloni hivi ama Okay wacha niuulize kama wanaipenda nganga kaloni Alafuta <laughs> 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 Wow. <laughs> okay, as we give you the opportunity, we give you a very very wide field so that you 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 open your mind and decide what you can do with what we give you. Like we cannot give you that information. Na lafta na tutoe pesa mfukoni to apati here. Yes. Because as I said in the beginning, iki to see you have a boss. You are employing yourself. Sure. So if you're telling me to give you a loan, that simply means <laughs> I'll go into my pocket to and have, give you the money. <laughs> that mm. You find that uh, when when you want to invest in cryptocurrency, invest what you have. It's not a matter that you have this kind of money. To oh, start okay. Mm. So okay. If you commence on blockchain technology, you can start with what you have. Then as you grow, buy, you become. So okay. All right. Hello, get your radio. Hi. Hello. All right, so, so thank you. Well, we're gonna go to my best work, but uh, you know it's 44 minutes past 12. Eh? It's quite interesting, Kabisa. That's the joy. This is the joy. This is the joy. Time we can do. Yeah. The joy. Time we can do. And maybe uh, briefly, you can talk about maybe the future. The future eh, of blockchain technology. Eh, and and Kujia kuimbia uja ma happy birthday ama tunatoka kumutuna mimi ya sayo. Yeah, so um, now that it has just arrived, uh, I do say anything that comes into existence comes to solve a solution. If I give you just a brief history, tukitoka hapo nyuma tulianza na bata trade. Ulikuna kuja na ngombe yako moja na kupea mbuzi, mbuzi wangu wa wili. Mm-hmm. Najua, but at the end of the day ulikuna pata kuna mtu anaenda nyumbane ajafurahia jaf, mm-hmm. because azitoshani. So then ke money, why money has a solution to bata trade? After money, sasa unapata countries like Uganda currency yako very low. Ukiwana 50k, itabidi kumebeba kwa gunia or something. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, so they brought in smart cards. You know, after smart cards, Zina kuja to solve a problem that was there. Okay, okay. so it, it, so uh-huh. after smart cards to kona M-Pesa digital money. So now that you don't need to carry anything, but you have money. So now cryptocurrency is coming in as a solution to the the decentralized money like Kenyan money Ugandan money because this is a money I can use in Kenya someone can else can use it in anywhere. Uganda mm-hmm. someone else can use it in UK it's the same we're making the world a small village so it is coming to to bring a solution to something so it's here to stay it, it, this is the future Okay. In, in in near time we will be cashless mm. we will be using this thing will it cover stuff like money laundering sasa vitu kama hizo Will it scab that? Yes, because you must pay tax. Ah. See, yes. Okay. Yes, you will pay tax. Like every transaction you make, you have to give your percentage to the government as usual. So they track what you do. Mm. You cannot launder money with it. Plus, it is it is on, um, on, how do we call it? It is on um, 
uh, yani kitu iko kwa simu ama kitu iko kwa internet yeah. hawezi awezi mm-hmm. badilisha na, so you cannot alter so in short kutakuwa na future za banka kuna kuna future ya bank banks are already <laughs> in here we saw you the other day talking about incorporating oh uh, the banks blo- and yes, okay. blockchain technology so they are already here they are okay. seeing the future okay yes. and what about waizi sasa kutakuwa na kuizi kuibado utaibaje <laughs> because the thing is <laughs> the thing is with this phone of mine you do not know how much it has yeah. hata nikaipoteza leo na upoteze wallet yako you not recover what you have yes. but for me intend that una renew line mm. and i have my money back okay that's how safe it is interesting <laughs> interesting yes 47 minutes past 12 o'clock na kuja kumalizia na this is happy birthday to you <laughs> charles kuku how many years old enough <laughs> so so uh, I play you exclusively this tune by Maji Maji. Uh, happy birthday as she celebrate your birthday today. I wish you many many more returns. Thank you so much. Yes happy birthday to you Chalo nimeambia nikwambia hivyo na mpesa ya kabete eh you live to to, to uh, blow a thousand candles ati tunakuja kula keki aja kuja na keki ningekuanisha kuambia <laughs> Ojioni. <laughs> ah yes, sawa sawa. So, tunakuja kumalizia. And uh, the most important thing ni blockchain technology wako na uh, summit. It's called the uh, cryptocurrency uh, blockchain technology cryptocurrency entrepreneurship and e-commerce summit. Itakuwa po uh, All Saints Cathedral on uh, Thursday the 13th of September from Sanani. So, kama uko willing sana sana kujoi biashara. Na sana acha 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 nani uh, Christine Christine ana an advocate madem especially madem sana sana wakuje yes. eh, wajue story si ndio Christine yes, mm-hmm. for women yeah. I want women to be uplifted mimi najua kukuwa dem ni nini najua kukuwa dem na kukosa ina maanisha nini mm. I know to what extent a girl can go to when they do not have mm. so I'm reaching out to ladies kindly kindly come and uh, you can also follow akina uh, Christine kwenye page yao inaitwa Crypto Alliance uh, Crypto 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 Alliance, crypto Alliance lifestyle. lifestyle on Facebook <laughs> yes a uh, Crypto Alliance lifestyle na pia Charles Kuku ni zamtafuta kwenye Facebook eh nimemtaga hapo kwa post ya GR eh pia umfuate otherwise maybe final or parting shot start with you, starting with you Charles ladies first Oh ladies first men ahead <laughs> men ahead <laughs> Ah no um today I'm privileged to be here thank you for hosting me You're welcome uh, my intention was to reach out to the youth I hope I have mm-hmm. and now I want to see change in the youth I don't want to see I don't want to see people sit and wait kindly hey. just come and listen Kujia, we will give you the support you need if we see you have the potential we will give you the support you need and we see you change your life ni nataka siku moja mtakuja hapa seme the same testimony i'm saying hmm. i'm not using my degree but i have the money you hmm. know hmm. yes so asante sana oh, you're welcome yeah. chance well uh, the blockchain technology to currency and e-commerce is huge what you need to do identify something that can fit you your passion where you are the drive and then do something with it mm-hmm. start from where you are mm-hmm. yes and also we encourage the youth to turn out to our summit on Thursday mm-hmm. so that they can come and hear more than what you just talked about this was just a brief one mm-hmm. you will explain everything more yes. yeah Okay. Thank you so much. You can follow me on Twitter at Charles Okuku, Facebook page Charles Okuku and Instagram Charles Okuku. We really appreciate. You're welcome. Information is power and uh, kama umesikia umesikia na kama utaweza kufika, I eh, mean like lazima nifike niangalie. Unajua kama hiyo blockchain imeni I mean hiyo Bitcoin imeni uma hivyo. Hata nene nione kama uh, kuna opportunity zingine zimebaki mali naweza chanukia. Otherwise, from Miss Alina Njoki the Brown Girl Brown at the Dark Tales you again next week. In Inshallah, uh, same same time from 11 o'clock to 1 o'clock only on Kenya's number one Geto Radio 89.5. Shoni Chanuka Dada and uh, nakuacha na kijuso Raviani featuring Queen Dalin at uh, 55 minutes past 12 o'clock. Good afternoon on the second Sunday of September for the year 2018.